Hey, crypto family, hope y'all are doing good today. So today we're gonna to talk about a project that I am extremely excited about. It's called Parsec, and it's a real-time blockchain monitoring analytics tool. So it basically allows for if X then Y statements for smart triggers that can activate events that DeFi participants and protocols can use. So this is an amazing project and I'm definitely excited to tell you all about it and what things they have working on for the future and why I think they can grow at least 10x from their current valuation. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. So currently looking at Parsec, we can see it's up 16% today. So this is amazing. Um, it is outperforming a lot of altcoins today and I think it's just getting started. And you see here, they came all the way from five cents back in August of last year. And now they've already grown to $1.50 and they're still ranked 273. So still a long ways to go to get to that top 100. So definitely think a lot of growth could happen here. And then for those interested in where they can buy it, again, you have Polynex, Uniswap, OKEx, One Inch, Hotbit, and Gate.io, and then a few others. But with that, let's actually talk about what Parsec does and what makes them so different from a lot of these other altcoins. So first, let's talk about Parsec Monitoring Solution. So this is a link that I'm actually gonna put in the description and in the comments. It basically breaks down what Parsec does in a nutshell. So if we scroll down here to the second page, it says, Parsec Monitoring is a way to be notified about big sells or buys on a DEX or monitor specific selling whales in a project enabling manual front running before big sell-offs and leveraging some very nice arbitrage opportunities, all very important abilities when trading small caps. So I don't know if you know exactly what that means, but basically like you can monitor wallet addresses for big buys or sells. So if you know a certain whale always transfers, you know, certain coins to different addresses right before there's a big sell-off, then yeah, you can monitor that address. So a lot of these things, it's real-time data, and that's what makes it so different than other coins. There's actually a coin in the top 100 I'm going to talk about um, that Parsec is actually a lot better than it. So I'm going to talk about that towards the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. But if you go down here, you can see there's arbitrage opportunities you can take advantage of with these front-running, um, these different, uh, basically, wallet addresses that are transferring coins. And then basically all you do is you find the Uniswap contract address or whatever contract address you're trying to find for certain wallet addresses. And then once you set that up in your quick monitoring trigger wizard, then basically it'll notify you for every buy or sell that happens on the Uniswap contract. So let's actually go right now to their website um, so you can see exactly how to do that. So the website is parsic.net and I'm actually gonna link that as well in the description. But when you go to their website, you can see here that you can try it for free, go ahead and create an account. And actually down here, it tells you what exactly you can set. So you can see here, it says scalable, work with millions of transactions across different blockchains, easy to use integrations, and then it's flexible with defining how you want to use the data. Now, down here it says instant notifications, so I really like this because you can actually send it to a Telegram bot to notify you, or you can actually send it via Slack. So Slack messaging app, if y'all use that, uh, it's a very cool messaging app. So there's all kinds of different ways you can actually get these alerts. And then you can see here, they can actually specifically set what you wanna do and he says customize your workflow and then be creative with exactly what you wanna monitor, whether it's price, um, you know, certain coins moving to certain wallets, all kinds of different things you can set here, different web hooks, and you can also export your data and analysis. So a lot of these paid plans that they have as well and that allow you to do this and export all this data. So, you know, maybe you have a wallet address that you've seen transferred X amount of days, you can monitor that and how much they've transferred and kind of plot that and then extrapolate, okay, this guy always, you know, transfers money on a Wednesday or just something like that to where you can get more data and actually give you that market edge. So once you create an account, you'll come up to this page here and you can see here that on the left side, you have alert monitors and then transports. So our projects and transports I actually name these alert monitors so it can make it easy to read for y'all. But basically all that happens is first you want to go to transports, add a transport, and basically it'll this will connect you to your Telegram um, alert. So all you have to do, it'll give you a QR code you can scan or you can just say connect to Telegram and you click that and then it'll actually bring up a page where you can link it to your Telegram. So how that's gonna show up actually is you can see here that right here it says, uh, and it'll say start. And basically when you click start, it says your Telegram transport has been configured. You can now receive notifications from your triggers. So just a cool thing um, that you can do there and basically it makes it really simple and you'll see it's connected here so then now what you can do now you can go to your um 
you can go to your alert monitors here and then from here you can actually create a quick monitoring trigger wizard so all you have to do is once you create that um, we'll go ahead and click on this here then you can paste uh, the wallet address of what you want to monitor so i just did a bitcoin address here and then labeled it bitcoin out of this uh, drop down here and then now we can add a customization so for example say the amount if the amount is more than or equal to let's say one million dollars okay so there you go one million dollars so basically what happens and then we'll click update and for this it'll be our telegram alert bot that we basically want to get the alert for so basically what this is going to do is if this wallet address transfers one million dollars then it'll give you an alert to your telegram alert bot so you can see and there's all kinds of more customizations you can do with this but this is just one of the very few things you can do so definitely something useful you can do and then after that um, then you can go back to your alerts and you can add another if you want but this is a great way to do this and then they also have paid plans so if you want to upgrade your subscription here just click that and you have the 49 dollars per month and then you have a thousand actions per month that that'll allow you multi-step quick monitoring web hooks telegram google sheets blockchain market data etc and then you have the business model because they do this with a lot of businesses right if they want to monitor all kinds of different outflows and inflows 399 dollars and you have all these different steps so different pricings uh, again they have a free option as well so you know go ahead and mess with this and it's very very cool what you can do with all this stuff and just what you can monitor with different addresses um, because it can kind of get you to front run, you know, before a big move happens. So it's definitely useful. But now we're actually going to talk about the partners of Parsec and exactly who they've partnered with. And uh, there's actually some big names here. So as you can see right here, you know, some of the partners they've had is Dex Network, Solana, Ave, Superfarm, and Injective Protocol. So we're actually going to cover um, a couple Medium articles that they had and what exactly this means for them going forward and what abilities and um, different opportunities that you have with them partnering with these different protocols. So first, let's go ahead and cover the injective protocol. So for injective protocol, it's a layer two DEX that allows for margin trading, derivatives, and futures. And PRQ allows users to create if X then Y rules, such as if asset X falls below you know, Z dollars, sell asset X for USDC, or let's say if asset X hits price Z, trigger a take profit on X. So that's something that's, again, is very unique. And because it's partnering with Injective Protocol, that is something that is very useful. So um, definitely something that's good for partnering with them. And then you also have Aave. So for Aave, they're a borrowing and lending protocol. So that allows users to earn passive income. So Basically, them partnering with Aave can allow users to create like if X, then Y rules. So if the loan to value reaches X, deposit more assets into Y to avoid liquidation. And uh, basically, it'll tell you when someone makes a deposit to a pool, when someone makes a withdrawal from a pool, um, or when someone borrows funds from a pool. So uh, a lot of uses for there. So again, that's just one of the other ways that you can integrate Parsec um, for all these different web hooks to integrate with these other platforms. And then finally, they have Super Farm, which is actually um, an NFT. Uh, it's a cross-chain default protocol that allows users to deploy crypto and NFT farms with no code required. So with Parsec actually partnering with Super Farm, it says it'll be utilizing Parsec's real-time monitoring technology as an important piece of infrastructure to watch gamers' wallets for NFTs, to unlock unique in-game items, and with more functionality on the way. So. That's pretty amazing because you can watch like say a gamer has a certain wallet and it has NFTs in it. Well, you can monitor that wallet for when there's, you know, say a new NFT that gets in it or is withdrawn from it. So a lot of different uses here for utilizing Parsec technology on the Super Farm network. And then right here, they partner with the DEX network, which this one is an amazing one. And it says they're partnering with DEX and upcoming social trading DEX with some very interesting products offered to clients. Dex offers an advanced copy trader system for their clients to actively follow other wallets and mimic their trades across a long list of supported exchanges. So that's pretty amazing, um, being able to actively follow other wallets and mimic their trades. So with Parsec, I mean, you can have all kinds of data and webhooks you can put with this. And that is definitely something that puts them one step ahead and just that more data you can get for these different wallets and different clients that you can monitor. 
And then last but not least, we have Parsic with Solana. So partnering with Solana has been huge. I don't know if you've seen Solana's price action in the past couple of weeks, but DeFi has been huge. And for Parsic, partnering with Solana basically allows them to integrate with the Solana ecosystem so you can basically integrate with the either wallet addresses or things that are going on in the Solana ecosystem, whereas you could not before. So basically having Parsic now integrated with Solana, it says users on the Solana network can now reap all the benefits from the Parsic ecosystem using Parsic's push-based data stream aggregator that adds a programmability level on top of real-time data streams. Parsic allows users to combine independent data streams and write arbitrary scenarios in reactive style using our easy scripting language. So this is amazing. And um, again, Solana is going to be huge in the future. So Parsic par partnering with Solana is uh, definitely a long-term advantage for the growth of Parsic. Now let's go over their Q&A that they had recently. And they posted this on their Twitter. If you aren't following their Twitter, it's at Parsic underscore net. Now, this Q&A um, was just released a day ago, and there's some great information in here and some good announcements, actually, that has me really excited for the future of Parsic. So it says here, are there any information updates that the team can provide regarding collaborations with Polkadot or Parachange? And they said, wait for April. So with the wink face, that tells you there's going to be some announcements. And then they talked about Uniswap v3. And it says, we will have to see whether or not current pools are migrated or not. Either way, we support NFTs as well. So monitoring LP tokens or NFT doesn't make much difference for us. So that's amazing. Um, they can monitor that. And then there's also some big announcements here that I actually was excited about. If you scroll down here, you can actually see, it says, um, are we going to see more non-fungible token liquidity pools in the future? With Uniswap V3 coming, they're implementing this kind of liquidity pool. Is IQ better or are they doing different things? And IQ is a protocol I'm going to talk about um, in a couple minutes. It says, these are different things. You will know all the specifics and uniqueness of the IQ protocol on the 31st when technical paper will be released. As not yet quite like anything that exists in the industry. So this March 31st announcement is very, very huge. Um, if you don't know about it, definitely wait for this announcement. A lot of people are buying Parsec in anticipation of this announcement. And as you can see, all the partnerships they've had, I mean, it's a big deal. So uh, definitely, definitely keep that in mind, that March 31st date. And then it says about the IQ protocol will be available from launch. It says Ethereum is a given about being on Ethereum. We are considering launching on Binance Smart Chain and or Solana for the first round of networks for launch. An interface for Coin Metro should follow after launch. So <laughs> this is huge too, on the Binance Smart Chain and or Solana. I mean... Binance Smart Chain and Solana. That was actually the video I made just before this saying how DeFi and the Binance Smart Chain is growing like crazy. Um, you've seen PancakeSwap on the Binance Smart Chain. That's gone up a lot. You've seen Solana go up a lot. Uh, this is going to be huge for Parsec, and I cannot wait for it. And then it says, when moon, we expect 2021 to be a stellar year for Parsec. We are on the track to launching some big partnerships, heavyweight clients as well as token listings, and some major surprises that we are keeping close to the vest. So... Uh, yeah, this is a lot of good stuff, and I cannot wait uh, to see Parsec grow from here. And then, last but not least, let's actually talk about Parsec's IQ protocol. So, this is going to be a big deal, and this is something that uh, I've really been looking forward to. So, their IQ protocol is uh, launching on the testnet Ethereum, and release of technical paper is scheduled for March 31st. This will be an industry first for a DeFi protocol of such kind, a risk-free collateralist decentralized finance protocol to tokenize SaaS subscriptions as well as real world services by creating a circular economy around them. So the reason why this IQ protocol is so big is because it's a lending borrowing protocol that's decentralized, open source, risk-free and collateralist. So the IQ protocol will basically allow you to stake your coins and learn, um, earn actually more staking rewards from this. And it says Parsec's new tokenomics is set to launch in Q2 as well. After Parsec's new tokenomics model and IQ protocol launch, Parsec users and clients will be required to hold PRQ tokens to use the platform. So not spend, just hold. So this will get the model of holding tokens to get access to services or featured. It's called on-chain subscriptions and will be one of the most widely adopted monetization models in all of SaaS going forward. So if you've been familiar, you know, as you hold the coins, the supply goes down, 
If the demand goes up or stays the same, then the price will just continue to rise. So standard economics there, but that's amazing that uh, they're gonna implement this and it'll just create more hype for the coin and more people holding the coin. And it'll says how it works. DeFi token holders and lenders can deposit their tokens, PRQ in the case of Parsec and any other tokens when other projects begin utilizing the protocol for their tokenomics into the pool. So this is gonna be amazing. And then this actually covers how the uh, how Parsec's upgraded tokenomics is set to launch in Q2 along with the IQ protocol mainnet. So originally you could purchase necessary amount of PRQ from the market and hold, um, but the problem this created was clients who wanted needed to monitor millions of addresses and automate millions of workflows. Uh, basically, it wouldn't make sense for them to purchase that many tokens. And then when onboarding these customers, they don't want the friction of dealing with any tokens. So this option two here, where you have the IQ protocol, is you can borrow or rent PRQ via this IQ protocol by paying a fee without any collateral. So now the lenders can earn passive income, risk-free, more demand for the token, less tokens and active circulation. So this IQ protocol is gonna be huge. And this is definitely something that I've been looking forward to. Um, it's definitely a big deal and one that I think is going to be uh, make a splash whenever it does release. So definitely uh, keep in mind that IQ protocol and it is going to be really, really big for the future and something that I cannot wait. Now, last but not least, we're going to talk about the competitor, you could say, um, to Parsec and it's Graph. Now, Graph is actually an indexer as well but it's an indexer for past indexes, not current indexes like Parsec is. So this is huge because when you see Graph right now, it's ranked 46 at 2.17 billion market cap. And then you look at Parsec and it's 164 million. I mean, that's nearly a 13X um, to get to the same rank and market cap as Graph. So I think there's a lot of opportunity for Parsec and I think there's definitely um, it's a good price right now. Again, not financial advice, but maybe set some buy levels for a little bit lower to catch a dip. And definitely, um, this is a long-term project that I'm very, very looking forward to and cannot wait to see the future of Parsec. So if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Um, if you want to follow me on Twitter or Discord, I have that up as well. Ask me any questions on there. But till next time, thanks for watching.